Hello, hello everyone, or welcome back. Bogmod here, and I want to say things went great for us. Oh, it's fine. Totally okay with this. We are now, so Emperor Baldrick has given up the ghost at the age of 69. Dead natural death, a humble man, he never wanted to make anyone fuss over his accomplishments. A godly man, he is now the Blessed Virgin. Rodedric is four years old. And has left the capable hands of Regent and Council. Long live Emperor Diederik. So be it. So, let's pause for a moment. So, first things first. We, this is us. Emperor Diederik of the Holy Roman Empire. Now, one thing I would like you to note, aside from his many lands, his great armies, his vast gold reserves, his already existing marriage, and the fact that he has a lisp, is that uh, he has a bloodline. Ah, but not just any bloodline, not just one bloodline, but he has the blood of his father, Emperor Balderic, who is the archetypal warrior philosopher, who has become legendary for coupling the fierceness of a fighter with the mind of a scholar. Yet, in the year 600, the line of Attila the Hun was founded. And uh, we can trace our lineage back to him. But in 868, Arpad Arpad, who founded, uh, who was the, the sacred ruler of the Magyar tribes, conquered Carpathia Basin and made it home for the Hungarians. With all that. But also, also, the immortal blood of Alexander the Great has been linked to our family line. Which is fantastic. So he possesses four bloodlines. The woman he is set to marry, his niece, who is actually older than he is, she possesses also the Carolingian bloodline. Oh yes. Oh! Yes. The question now becomes, can I live long enough to see them all happen? Apparently we cannot nominate our brother to be emperor. But I will nominate my half-sister for now. Our beloved mother is now regent. Uh, that is from Emperor Baldrick, if you want to keep it. Uh, yes, I will take care of the, very, the, the, the amazing book. Okay, my Chancellor, the Bohemia, who possesses Boslav the Cruel bloodline. He is now my, my leader, now my regent. Tell you what, I'm going to give you an honorary title. I'm going to make you my High Almoner. Just to show how much I think you're an awesome guy. Mm. Robbing defense, uh, defend against a jihad for Egypt. Uh, here's my sister. Oh, it's a twin. She visits a lisp, just like me. And a twin brother. It's fine. All of those are great. They have the fantastic bloodlines of fantastic bloodlines. My mother. 
my mother's gonna marry anyone, and I'm not against it, it will be somebody. Empress Dowager, does he regent? Is there anyone with a bloodline? I know what we can do. <laughs> yes, actually, hold on a second. Ledgers. What is the world? No bloodlines. There we go. Hmm. Uh, all right, let's take a look at this bloodline. Mm -hmm. Let's look for the young ones. Oh, yeah. There we are. We can marry him to my mother. Matrilineally, which I will do. There we are. Uh, send you a gift. Oh, all right, I'm fine. It's fine. Doesn't have to be religion. Yada yada yada. It's fine. The important thing is we're going to get more people with the Rurikid bloodline. Which I can then splice into the main family tree and acquire yet another bloodline. That seems to be my current goal, is to steal all the blood. I mean, I'm not against it. I'm just noting it is the current trend. Let's see, the Pope is upset with the law of free investiture. I'll throw some money at the Pope to make him go away. New court chaplain. Alright. This bishop likes me. And that is what we want. We want bishops who like me. How about you, buddy? What's your bloodline? There we are. Some good blood. The jihad failed. Wonderful. No doubt, thanks to my amazing leadership. A lot of usurping. Air, my half brother. Uh, brother, I notice you, first of all, you're a theocrat, but also you're a heretic. Why are people voting for you? That seems unwise. Um, you know what? I'd prefer him over anyone else. Uh oh. Oh no! Heretics. Heretics. Can I not just imprison heretics for no reason? Except beyond the fact that they're heretics? Oh well. It's fine. Mm -hmm. 
my beloved mother. Oh no, mother, why? Why, mother? Wait, wait, hold on. Was that just happened? I just gained prestige. <gasps> my, he, yes, good. He's being beautified, which means he's on his way to possibly becoming a saint. I can have saint blood in my body. Mm, saint blood. That'd be amazing. Very amazing. But for now, we will hold off. We will instead enjoy our military might. A personal might. A rebellion. And there is this guy. Oh no! Cock governor. I will have to destroy him now. Oh yes. Oh yeah. Oh, where are you even from? Henrik, eh? Henrik Fleming, a Swedish pagan Viking. See, so that's an interesting thing to check. Where are the Vikings? There does not appear to be any... No, there doesn't appear to be any Viking territory left. I wonder where he came from. Teleport my generals in. Smack him around for his insolence. Also, throw him into the jail. Broken spirit. Excellent. This makes me pleased. Very pleased. Alright, cool. Uh, sadly, this is going to be a little while. I can't do too much. You know what? Go do your own thing, buddy. Oh, was it, I thought you were being... I thought you were attacking. Oh, no. Okay, that's why. All right. Well, we'll let it play out. We'll see what happens. Uh, 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 why did you have to be a true believer? Why? Oh, 
All right. Well, we can at least now start to have an education. Uh, I'm going to take an education in fussy patient, greedy, or paranoid. Mm -hmm. Shrewd, cynical, or some of these films. Shrewd's useful. Let's be thrifty. Well, I think we convinced him to not bother us anymore. For now, at least. Good! The Duke converted. That is wonderful news. Um, ooh, there's a thought. Any gender. Looking for rulers. Uh, any we want rulers, yes. Search my vassals. Oh, all right. I'm gonna do this by rank. So the king of Bohemia. Oh. Is so my regent is a heretic. All right, well that happens. Maybe not. Can I convince you? No, maybe not. Uh, right, let's get a new... 31 points! You know what? I'm going to send you there, and maybe you can convince my cousin, my heretical apostate of a cousin, to change his religious views. Oh, Mother, welcome back. At least we can trust that the Prince Archbishop of Brandenburg is not a heretic. At least we can do that much. At least we can trust King Leaf, the Butcher. Probably won't kill me. Yeah, buddy. How about I uh, give you an honorary title of being uh, my high alm... No, my master of the hunt. Yeah. Even if you don't have any magical blood. A big boy now. Or I can become fussy. Hmm. I like I'd, I'd like to acquire a little personality. Um, nope. Hello, half sister. Heretic. Uh, filthy heretic. Well, at least I can convince uh, stepdad to change his religious views, and then, oh, mom, why do you have to be a true heretic believer? Oh, it's terrible. Oh, well. uh, anyways, we are we are also six years old now, so I should probably start thinking about 
the next wars I want to wage. Germany, not especially. Bavaria, though. The Mongols. Where's we just the Abyss Khan from beyond the Great Mountains and Sarah Tuna, the clan of the Great Step. The start of this Khan is destined to become the ruler of the world. Oh, he's got a bloodline. Blood of Temujin. The Sky Burials, Hunter Pinion, Mongol. Hmm. Perhaps we can acquire it. Yeah, no putting critting kings right now. Oh, I do do want to have a court physician though. That is something I do want. Score of 11 is not enough for me to accept your heretic ways. All right. And we are going to take a little break here, so thank you all for watching. We'll come back soon, but for now, we're going to continue to enjoy the fact that we have this amazing... I mean, he's, he's six years old, but he has a personal combat skill of 26. Blood of the Blessed Baldric. Blood of the Blessed Baldric. Blood of Attila. Blood of Arpad. Immortal Blood of Alexander. Hopefully we can get that Carolingian blood in for our kids soon. It'll be great. Anyways, thank you for watching. I'll see you soon for more.